Hello and welcome to how to make animations in Game Maker. Well, today I'm going to show you like how to make animations in Game Maker. So, basically, the animation is just in the sprite. Oh, so just get. It's going to need one sprite to do this. So I'm going to make an enemy sprite. But I want my enemy to not just move because I can program that but move body parts like move his arms so I'm gonna call it sprite enemy and I'm just gonna quickly draw one like this use yellow undo that's a bit big undo. So just make like a basic enemy, maybe a circle or something. And now I'm going to draw him some arms that I want to move. So I want them to start off up. Then now I'm going to make his eyes. So I just want his eyes just black. So it's a bit big. Come down one. That's better. They're my eyes for him. That there. Get some yeah, just edit it, make it a look make it a look bit good. Okay, just something like that. And then one of my personal favourite features you I like the mouth. So just what I usually do, I make his when his arms are up, his mouth is open. So open it like that. Um that then get some pink. So the inside of his mouth is gonna be pink. Like for the gum and everything. Get some black. So once you've made your um character click OK might look a bit weird but um, click copy which is that one then paste it eight times paste it one more time then on the ninth time you're going to edit it so zoom in so what I do I that again. Do I cut the arms off like that? Move the arm, and I'm going to put it down there so his arm's gone down. Now I need to get rid of this arm, so I'll cut that and put that one there. Or sometimes you can just completely delete it. And draw them again. So, get my yellow. Draw his arms down like that. Now I want his mouth to be closed for this one, so he changes a bit. So just go like that. Okay. And then copy that and paste that a few more times. So there should be 16 images. Eight arms up. Eight arms down. That shows your preview. It should look like that. And then you can just make that into an object. Collision with player. Main one restart room. Okay. Then you can do all sorts of things with him create move sideways different speeds select speeds and you can also make it he can come outside if he goes off the screen he can come back on the other side so other outside room on move wrap screen horizontal okay go to our room 
and put the enemy there. Put in there. Okay. And it should look like this. So now you've got your own enemy that you've got to jump in if you touch him, restart the game, or the room, or whatever.